What advice would you give to someone who is considering doing a PhD? Don't do it. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, I think it's obviously a very worthwhile thing to do, but think about what do you want to do afterwards? And is this the best path to get there? Mm. So it's maybe a bit boring, but what helped me a lot was to think not so much about, you know, you can do it and um, uh, trying to boost yourself in like positive thinking, which I think is part of it. Mm. But what really helped me was to think about the practical things mm. about how to actually do a PhD, when to work, like plan your time, have these like crazy little schedules, uh, Monday to Friday, and trying to plan what I should actually do during this time, because mm. you do set your own schedule. Um, and uh, I think for me that really helped. Uh, if, if you're determined to do a PhD, I would really recommend to um, be sure that your supervisor is the kind of supervisor that you want and that you need for your work, because every, you know, the, the relationship with the supervisor is a very important um, aspect of, of the PhD. And, and the main struggle of, of some colleagues of mine, the people I know in their PhD, really, uh, it's re related to their relationship with their supervisor. Yeah, maybe before you start, like think about the, uh, to reflect already about where, like a PhD, obviously, like is a, is like a whole pathway and it's four years by itself. But where is this go PhD going to carry you? Because you are going to learn get to know many people, you're going to learn a lot of uh, aspects from like a scientific standpoint. Like which fields are you going to, uh, you know, which are like fields that are challenging you enough that you can expand within them also in the future. Um, and then, uh, and then listen a bit to yourself, but also listen to your supervisor. Yeah, I would say the most important thing is to, to make sure that you love the topic that you will be studying for the next four or five years or however long. Um, because the PhD is really this sort of a roller coaster ride of ups and downs and um, if you don't have a solid foundation of, of motivation and inspiration and love for your topic, then those downs can be really difficult to get through. Mm. Um, and you know, a lot of people don't finish their PhDs because they, they don't have something to get them through those low points. Mm. So um, make sure you love your topic. Mm.